Good afternoon, everyone. Good afternoon, Chair. โอเคแต่ทีนี้คณะเตรียมรับไปทางไลน์มาก่อนโอเค Shall we turn now? Um, I think I give a uh, homework, right? For this one. Yeah. Yes. <clears throat> so what did you write for number four? This one. What is your answer? Huh? What is your answer for number four? Teacher, yeah, I'm typing. I'm typing, okay. Type long in Johnny Mawadai, so it's up behind. Johnny Mawadai. All right, so I should or I shouldn't? I shouldn't. Have done so much. Have, then, yes, I shouldn't have eaten ice cream or I shouldn't have eaten too much, right? You can write like that. So how about number five? You have to use I wish. So I wish I hadn't seen up so late. So how about number six? I wish I... I wish I had done it yesterday. I had done that yesterday, okay? So is there any other different answer? Okay, I got it. I wish I had done more homework. Okay, yes. So is there any other different answers? No, okay. So we'll uh, move to number seven. You have to use if only this time. So if only I had done some revision. Now I can answer the test like that, right? So how about number eight? We can see a virus attack or something like that, right? So what can we write by using if only? If only I Okay, if only I had opened that file. Okay, on Campbell. How about the others? How did you write the answer for number eight? If only I had opened that file. Do you know about typing the other thing? If only I have I have them <clears throat> open to WhatsApp. Okay, and yes, Lena. Do you know about typing the other thing? If only I had installed the antivirus application or something like that, right? So you can also write like that. Okay. Also, yeah, my question. Do you have any number one? Lee. Oh. How? Yeah, man. That's another yeah, man. No, think lady. So I can see you like that. you you Thank you. Okay, so we'll move to number two now. Use the words in the box to complete the test about the advantages and disadvantages of email. email. So we will have to fill this blank by using the what from the box, right? Okay, let's do it now. And after that, we'll check together, okay? And if these are all the script from the listening recording, right? So just to remember what they are talking about in the recording text.
So shall we check now? Okay. So uh, we'll look at the advantages of the milk first. So it is very quick. Quick. Okay. It is very quick. You can send a message and it's usually arrived. Right. Arrived. Yes. Arrived a few seconds later. And you can send, send a message and uh, anywhere in the world. And it is not expensive. Expensive, yes. Expensive. It is cheaper than testing. Testing, yes. Testing. And how about and you can send the same message. Message, yes. The same message to lots of different people at the same time. So we'll move to disadvantages now. Not everyone uses. Uses, yes. Not everyone uses email. And you get quite a lot of Junk mail, yes. Junk mail from people wanting to sell things is really annoying, and sometimes it is just too, too quick, yes, too quick and easy. We write an email and send it without thinking, and then you wish, 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 yes, you wish you hadn't, and an email might have an. Hmm? For 11. Attachment or virus? Virus. Um, attachment. Attachment, right? Attachment with a virus, right? So for number 11 is attachment and for number 12 is the virus, right? It is better, right? Okay. So did you get all the answers for number two? Everyone? Yeah. Yes. Okay. So we'll move to number three. Read the email and what is wrong with it? So write your comments next to the email you should have or shouldn't have. Correct the spelling, grammar, and punctuation. Okay, so we'll do number two first. So did you see any spelling mistakes or grammar mistakes or punctuation mistakes? Let's find out what happened in the email. Okay. And after that, we'll discuss together. <clears throat> she was sick. Okay. Suzu is sick, right, Suzu?
So did you find them this day, Sarah? Yes, teacher. Yes, okay. So let's talk about the spelling mistakes here. So how many spelling mistakes did you find out? How many? Turn down with the spelling. Four. Four, okay, tell me what are they? I have. Uh, I have, actually it is punctuation mistake, right? Or I have, it is not spelled, right? It has to be I, most of B, E, right? So it is all about punctuation, right? So what I mean is spelling mistake. How many spelling mistakes can you find out? Night. Night, yes. Night and? And why? They are. <clears throat> they are, okay, they are. And? Noai, right? Someone yes. say me that. Noai. And? Mm. And? Really? Really, yes. So they are the spelling mistake, right? So for night, it has to be like N-I-T-H-E, nice, right? How about annoying? What is the correct spelling for annoying? A-N-N-O-Y-I-N-G. Yes, A-N-N-O-Y-I-N-G, annoying. And how about this one? It has to be D-R, right? And how about this one? Hmm? Really, right? It has to be double L, right? I-E-A-L-L-Y, really, yes. So these are the spelling mistakes. So how about, how about grammar? Is there any grammar mistake there? Wouldn't. Wouldn't. Is that grammar or punctuation again? Punctuation. Punctuation, right? Okay, I have to say punctuation in China. Punctuation is wouldn't. So it has to be W O U L D or story uh, story right? Wouldn't, right? <clears throat> wouldn't. And how about? I have. I have. I have, yes. I have. I have, right? I have. And I have to be capital letter, right? And any more? And don't know that there is a food store there, right? I got your email. I have a friend because I have BC, right? And how about this one? There's a punctuation mistake, right? With a capital. Yes, with all capital letters. It's kind of like shouting, right? So we can use like that. Don't send me emails late at night and my computer makes a noise when they come in and it's really it's annoying because it wake me up and you're just you are so there is a grammar mistake right it has to be you are right you are just as best as nicole right and she sent me text at two o'clock in the morning and they're really long and boring i wish you weren't sent then <clears throat> okay, so got it? Yeah. 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 Okay, so so you need to never the big one we got. So you need to mark the Bamidian CD then. You need to never the video. Bamidian CD. Bamidian CD last year, you see all you find. Not as I saw you need the bottom. Oh, the other people. You see all no? No, I have any. No, okay. <clears throat> okay, answer so you need the bomb. Uh, 
फाइव होता है मेडिसिन ဒီစမရီဝန်းသင်ရင်ဒါမှာစမရီဝန်းပြီးတော့ပြီးတယ်ဘူးเนาะโอเคအဲ့တော့မပြီးတယ်ဆိုရင်စပရိုကာစွ
I think it is kind of like difficult to play it, right? Yeah. Because it, the channel is on one team. Our uh, traditional sports, right? Yeah. Uh -huh. okay. So how about Pippi? What's your favorite sport for me? Swimming. Swimming. Okay, so you have same uh with Pippi, right? And how about Kenny? You got that one. What's your favorite sport? Uh, cycling. Cycling. Okay, same with Hong Kong. Okay. How about Shang Lei with me? Badminton. Play badminton. Okay. How about Ted and Rajo? What's your favorite sport? Here? Sure. Can I ask you something? Yes. Uh, can Aikido be counted as sport? Of course. We can count uh, that. Yeah. So my favorite sport is Aikido. Mm -hmm. Okay. So how about me, Dr. Kimberly? Uh, swimming. Swimming again, okay. How about Yapong Gu, Dan? What's your favorite sport? Yapong Gu, can you talk? Yapong Gu, Dan, how do you hear me? Hello, you can. Okay, we can hear you now. What's your favorite sport, Dan? Uh, for me, it's the badminton, tennis, I mean, all the sport because I like to play all the game because it's fun, uh -huh. energetic. Okay. And it's fun. I especially like it when I can play with my friends. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. So it is kind of like difficult to choose one, right? As you yeah. like so many sports. I like to play all the sport, you know? Okay. I don't, okay, want, okay. I don't want a favorite. Mm -hmm. I especially like it uh, when I play with my friend. Mm -hmm. Okay. So how about football to me? What's your favorite sport? I swim in badminton and cycling. Swimming, uh, but me playing badminton and uh, and uh, cycling, right? Okay. Yeah. So how about? <clears throat> oh, that's all right. Come on, said um, seventeen years we do like the program. Should you know? Okay. So okay, so there is um another question that we need to say. So is international sport important? So how do you think of the international sport? Are they important? Are they important? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Uh, international import, uh, sports are you know what what is what are international sports? Uh, international sports are about your land. That means okay. For example, like football, right? Yeah, so many years ago, many sports are sports to be right. International sports. International sports, yeah, as you see, and you can. Is that important? Yeah. Yes. So why do you think so? I feel like it's easy. Is proud of your country. Okay, you can proud of your you country. A match, you win a match. Um, country is proud of you. Okay, so if you win that sport, your country can be proud of you like that, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. So is there any other different idea with him? Is international sport important and why? Why it is important? If so, why it is important? Why it is important? Why it is important? It's a little bit of a To get the international relation, right? So, international relation is a little bit of a problem. So, 
you know, sports event, for example, if you're Olympic or Hundred Six, that international sports event to cool it. I must run in your pounds on like a garment which are in your pounds on because I'm not in We have a familiarity, a familiarity. Yalame, Yalabi Dark, relationship will come on it, it's a relationship of my elders. To get, uh, it can bring the world together or something like that, right? So, so that is why international sports is really important, right? So do you agree with me? Yes. 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 Okay. Yes, but no, so in Tabini, I'm on the video. Yes, I agree with you like that, right? So smart. Okay. All right, listen in. Listen in, Marlene. Listen to the commentaries and look at the pictures on the page. Which sport is the of your time? All right. Do I? Listening, uh, listening, I'm not doing sports day down, build up, build up, you are to build on sports day. Behind is a judge, tied up in the Viana. All right, I have a look in the Algashi, that he sports my buyer to get leisure in the young Timothy, you know, whether you know or not. Okay, so we'll look at the first one here. What is that? What is the name of the sport? You know that game, right? You know that sport, right? So, what is goggles? What is goggles? It's okay, you can explain in our mother tent. It is okay. What is goggle? Goggles of Island. Yep, man. Yep, man. Yes, yep, man. So, he, for example, like the skin solution, he never sees the thing or do to cover the snow or to cover the sunlight, right? We use it, this kind of like glasses, right? So, that is goggles. And how about pole? What is pole? Uh, what is that? Uh, pull up island. <laughs> you know that one, right? It's kind of like thick, right? We used to keep a balance to, uh, for ourselves, right? So that is kind of like thick. So we call that it is a pole, right? So balance the pull or do it. No, a charm for the number 10 master. Uh, keep balance of the tongue and heart, right? The game is a pool of art, right? And there is a speed there. And how about this one? What is that? Ice skating. Ice skating, right? Ice skating, and there is a skate, right? So how about this one? What is the name of the game? Boxing. Boxing, yes. And we can see the boxing gloves and the ring, right? So what is the ring? How do we call that the ring in our language? Ring ring. So ring only. You might have blue You might have blue be an egg on. Now we do one hold on. The number two wine, you hold on. So eight and eight in Colombia because I don't want to write my two day. I hold on. I was a ring of honor. We know I'm a model to be an emergency. That we do one more, right? Okay. So how about this one? How about this game? The game was a blue collar. You want to be home bit. They come yellow car, yes, and your mama, they come. Otherwise, you came out there. I don't know in the do. You came out there at the distance for the game, right? At the distance, you are out there. Come here, I don't know. And after that, the US mother is a track and field car. The same game, I should do it. Game to do well, my child. Call what you were going to. You came out at the distance for it. US mother, track and field car. So, your mama, they come here. I don't know. And how about this one? I hope. Ice hockey, right? Ice hockey. And what is that? Puck, right? We call it puck. Puck, Babali Len. Hockey, Yalu, Kora, Hoda. I got me, Jai, your story, I said. Follow. A low lot of Yala. Puck, Gali, so a low lot of Yala, and I'm in. A Yali, brother, a Yali, Hoda, not a puck, Lia. Ali is your star, so follow my home. Ali is your default, my jet, your money. Ali is your body. Go about the DVC of the month. I am my star, right? Ice hockey. All right, probably is your hockey at Yali, right? So, how about this one? Tyler. Roll of lady. Roll of lady, yes. Our old lady's daughter is with my elbow pets. Where is the elbow pets? Grounded, <laughs> yes. 
to cover our elbow, right? So the elbow layer down is going to change our to cover low, low, young, elbow pet foot high. And I never wear that. Also, I never wear that. And it is quite dangerous, right? You have to wear that if you are using the rollerblading or skating or whatever, right? For your safety. And there will be like knee pads, right? As your elbow pads, you may, knee pads, you may, right? And how about this one, snowboarding, right? And snowboarding, and there is a snowboard, right? And how about this one? How about this one? Swimming. Swimming, yes, swimming. Our swim master is your cap. What is cap? Uh, nice. No, <laughs> And goggles, you also have to wear goggles, right? To cover your eyes from the water or the clothing, right? So you must have a goggle and there is a lane. What is lane? Lane from our eyes, right? What is lane? Jordan. Jordan. So, while I take good amount, lose nearly is here. Not really, nine is done. Eight nine is a lane of power. First lane, second lane, so, eight lane, two, two, and now, right? Lane of power. Okay. So, how about this one? Skateboarding. Skateboarding. Skateboard, skateboard, right? Skateboard. Or skateboarding, and there is a knee pad, right? Elbow pad, knee pad. And how about this one? Skateboarding. Horse riding. 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 UK. UK. UK as a UK or horse riding game will call it. US mother will call it. How do they call it? Horseback riding will call it. Right? Horseback riding and US mother as a horse riding as a UK mother. Right? Okay. Uh, brains. What is brains? Brains are mine. Me and Google. Yeah. I don't have to do it. 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 And rider, and there is a saddle. What is saddle? Saddle for my land. I don't know what to call it in our language. ยิ่งบอกมาเจนฮาเลยฮะเดี๋ยวมาจะไรเดอร์สิไทม์โมดูลจะตรงไหมฮะสตาร์ทโอเวอร์ขอเราเอาสมมติว่าเธอแลงก
without falling over. Three. Now, when you get into the ring, remember to hold your hands up so that your gloves protect your face. Four. I've only tried it twice, but I love being in the mountains. I fall over quite a lot, but I don't mind. I'd like to get my own snowboard. Five. I take my skateboard everywhere. I meet my friends at the park and we have a lot of fun. Most of us wear knee pads. You never know, you might fall. Six. I always wear elbow pads with my rollerblades. I wear knee pads as well. I hardly ever fall though, but it's better to be safe than sorry. Seven. I train every morning. I go up and down the fast lane. I always wear a cap and goggles. You have to wear a cap at the pool I go to and goggles protect your eyes. Eight. I rent my skis and poles, but I've got my own goggles. You need them when the sun's bright or when it's snowing. Nine. It's a game of great skill. You use your stick to hit the puck and to carry it as well. You have to be able to skate really well too. 10. I enjoy running, throwing the javelin and doing the high jump, but I'm best at running, especially the short distances like the 100 metres. So did you get all the answers? Okay, so I'll play it again to check your answer this time, okay? Track 10. One. Sit down in the saddle and don't hold the reins too tightly. That's good. You'll make a good rider. Two. I've got my own skates now. They're really comfortable. I can do a figure of eight without falling over. Three. Now, when you get into the ring, remember to hold your hands up so that your gloves protect your face. Four. I've only tried it twice, but I love being in the mountains. I fall over quite a lot, but I don't mind. I'd like to get my own snowboard. Five. I take my skateboard everywhere. I meet my friends at the park and we have a lot of fun. Most of us wear knee pads. You never know, you might fall. Six. I always wear elbow pads with my rollerblades. I wear knee pads as well. I hardly ever fall though, but it's better to be safe than sorry. Seven. I train every morning. I go up and down the fast lane. I always wear a cap and goggles. You have to wear a cap at the pool I go to, and goggles protect your eyes. 8. I rent my skis and poles, but I've got my own goggles. You need them when the sun's bright, or when it's snowing. 9. It's a game of great skill. You use your stick to hit the puck, and to carry it as well. You have to be able to skate really well too. 10. I enjoy running, throwing the javelin and doing the high jump, but I'm best at running, especially the short distances like the 100 metres. OK, so show check now. So number one is horse riding, right? So how about number two? What is that? What is that game? Ice skating. Ice, Ice skating. Yes, correct. Number two is ice skating. How about number three? Boxing. Mm -hmm. Boxing. Yes, correct. Number three is boxing, right? Yeah. And how about number four? What is the game? Snowboarding. Snowboarding, right? Correct. Snowboarding. And how about number five? Skateboarding. Skateboarding. Correct. Yes, skateboarding. 
right? Number five is skateboarding. And so how about number six? Rollerblading. Yes, rollerblading, correct. Rollerblading is number six. So how about number seven? Swimming. Swimming, correct. And how about number eight? Skiing. Skiing, correct. How about number nine? Ice hockey. Ice hockey. How about number 10? Okay. Athletics, right? Correct. So did you get all the answers for number one? Yes. Yes, teacher. Yes, okay. So for number two is play the vocabulary game with a partner and take it in turns to define and describe a sports player or an item or sport equipment in the picture on these pages. So your partner have to guess the words. So we have to play the vocabulary game. So I'll ask the questions and you have to give me the answer. For example, you need these when you are riding a horse, you hold them in the hands and they help you to control the horse. So how do we call this one? So your answer has to be like the reins, right? So we'll play that game after that. Uh, after this, uh, after this meeting number four, so we can we can get more vocabulary for that game. Okay. Alright, so who's going to solve the puzzle? So who's going to be the one 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 to be the and number three, I play Kim's game with a partner and look at the pictures on this uh, page for 30 seconds and close your eyes and uh, close your books. And can you remember all the words associated with each post? Uh, so let's talk about Kim's game. Kim's game is a memorizing game. So let's talk about the book. 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 ลูกชายเขาเปลี่ยนยกขีดไปนะเออตาแล้วลูกมีไว้เจอที่มาสิเกมอ่ะเซกอยู่ไว้ชี้เออเจอเจอเจอเนี่ยทรีเนี่ย
cycling, cycling, and they have to wear the helmet as they can fall over, and there is a bicycle, which is quite easy. And how about this one? Okay. Tennis. And we have to use the racket, right, to hit the ball, right? And there is also a net, right, between the two players. So got it? Okay. Yeah. So again, I will, I will play, okay? I will play the recording, and you have to decide the name of the game. So the Azama has been done again. The one is cricket, right? <clears throat> Track 11, one. That was an amazing ball from Monte Panassar. The batsman missed it altogether and it hit the stumps. So he's out first ball, incredible. Two. Murray comes into the net with his racket held high for a smash. Oh no, it's out. Love 15. Three. Number 10 has kicked the ball right between the posts. That's an amazing drop kick. That's three points to the All Blacks. Four. The ball has gone high over the net, and yes, it's a point for the home team. Five. He's won the championship for the third time in a row. He's holding the cup in one hand and the club he used for the winning shot. Even the caddy is smiling. Six. The goalkeeper reaches for the ball and it goes into the top corner of the net. Is it a goal? The referee's blown his whistle. It was a dangerous tackle. So that's a penalty. Seven. The batter's hit the ball. It's gone high. But the pitcher's caught it in his glove. So he's out. Eight. The cornerback has stopped the ball from reaching the goal post, and he's now running up the field with it. He's passed the ball to the quarterback, and now he's taking his helmet off. It looks as if he's got a problem, so there's going to be a substitution. Nine. The ball's hit the backboard, and yes, it's another basket for the Spanish team. Ten. It's the Colombian rider in front at the moment, wearing a yellow helmet. He's riding a specially designed titanium bicycle and he's looking really good. So guys, did you get the answers? Did you get the answers? Okay, so I'll play again to check your answers, okay? Track. Ball from Monte Panassar. The batsman missed it altogether and it hit the stumps. So he's out first ball. Incredible. Two. Murray comes into the net with his racket held high for a smash. Oh no, it's out. Love 15. Three. Number 10 has kicked the ball right between the posts. That's an amazing drop kick. That's three points to the All Blacks. Four. The ball has gone high over the net, and yes, it's a point for the home team. Five. He's won the championship for the third time in a row. He's holding the cup in one hand and the club he used for the winning shot. Even the caddy is smiling. Six. The goalkeeper reaches for the ball and it goes into the top corner of the net. Is it a goal? The referee's blown his whistle. It was a dangerous tackle. So that's a penalty. Seven. The batter's hit the ball. It's gone high. But the pitcher's caught it in his glove. So he's out. Eight. The cornerback has stopped the ball from reaching the goal post, and he's now running up the field with it. He's passed the ball to the quarterback, and now he's taking his helmet off. 
It looks as if he's got a problem, so there's going to be a substitution. Nine. The balls hit the backboard, and yes, it's another basket for the Spanish team. Ten. It's the Colombian rider in front at the moment, wearing a yellow helmet. He's riding a specially designed titanium bicycle, and he's looking really good. Okay, so shall we check now? So number one is cricket, right? So how about number two? Tennis. Tennis, yeah, correct. Number two is tennis. So how about number three? Rugby. Rugby, correct. Number two is rugby, right? And how about number three? Sorry, number three is rugby, right? How about number four? Volleyball. 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 Yes, correct. Volleyball is number four. How about number five? Golf. Oh. Golf. Correct. Golf. And how about number six? Talk. Football, right? Okay. Yes. Huh? Football, soccer, the same, right? <laughs> okay. So how about number seven? What is number seven? Please. Baseball. baseball, yes, correct. Baseball, and how about number eight? American. Hi, it's for number eight. Yes, American football, right? Is it that right? And how about number nine? Basketball. Basketball, correct. And how about ten? Cycling. Cycling, correct. Okay. So we have to go back Cycling. to the next one, right? Cycling. Now it's a coma, but you know. Okay. So number two, it's a coma. Now 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 it's a coma. Okay. Okay, all right. So number two, the one. Number two, the play the vocabulary game with a partner. So this is number four. Or this is number three. Maybe you watch TV. I'm just so wrong. One by one, maybe. All right. Who are you going to be talking to? Team Jota, no. So you have like um two or three minutes to look at the vocabulary, and after that, you have to close your book and you have to answer. Okay. okay. So just have a look at uh the vocabularies for all the twenty sports for three minutes. I'll give you three minutes, okay?
and then three minutes is up now, right? So, shall we play? So, close your book. And hold your book like that, so I can see you. <laughs> okay, so just kidding. Make sure that you close your book, okay? Okay, so can I ask now? So who wants to start first? Any volunteer? Any MPs are never on the street, right? The street, right? Okay, she was going to do that now. Okay, can you need though? I will start with you, okay? Yes. Okay. So, um, how do we call a stick that we use as a support one uh, we are skiing? How do we call that? There is a stick we use to support ourselves when we are doing skiing. Uh, I don't remember. You don't remember. So I will give you a hint. It starts with P. Skiing of their karma. Their karma balance time model dread. Dying tie I joke. Stick lady will call it. And it starts with P. Fitness eye. Oh. Is there a topic I mean? Can you smell ya? Pole, ski pole. Pole, yes, pole look on it, correct. Okay, can you, can you pick up next one for me? That's the other you go as well. Mia Pongo. Mia Pongo, okay. Mia Pongo, are you there? Uh, I don't think he is here. So can you call another one? Uh, I'll candle. <laughs> okay, I'll candle. Okay, so... Okay, how, how do we call a thing that we put on a horse back and the rider is sitting on it? How do we call that? Saddle. Saddle, correct. Okay, so can you pick up next one for me, Tiny A. Tiny A, okay. Tiny A, how do we call a black hat rubble used in a high ice hockey game? Uh, it's a like a black flat rubber thing and that we can use that in a hockey ice hockey game pack pack correct so can you pick up next one for me Billy? okay now hey yeah okay uh, how do we call a thing that we have to wear to cover our eyes from water or from the snow? Goggles. Goggles, yes, correct. Okay, so can you pick up next one for me? Mm, did you choose? I don't know, you have to choose. How about that? You like that, okay. Shun Lai Wei, okay, Shun Lai Wei, for me. How do we call a judge at a football game? A judge, yeah. They can talk about the rules for the players. How do we call that person? Um, hmm? So, follow me, Molly. Can you call it? 
referee free. Referee, yes, correct. So can you pick up next one for me? Um, <clears throat> okay, Okay, How do we call someone who has to carry the golf bag? Can you skip my turn? It's raining heavily and I can't hear you. You can't hear me? Uh, it's raining so heavily. Uh, it's raining so hard. Okay, so I'll ask you again. How do we call a person who has to carry the golf bag? Golf bag. Caddy. Caddy. Yes, caddy. Correct. So can you pick up next one for me, Dami? Me and Me and Me and Are you there with me? Uh, yes, teacher. Yes. Okay. So, um, uh, how do we call um? How do we call the lie in the swimming pool that a swimmer can swim inside that pool? Um, so how can we call that? Lay. Lay. Yes. Correct. So can you can you pick up next one for me? Susie. Susie, how do we call uh, someone who has to throw the ball at a cricket game? Uh, can you tell me again? How do we call someone who has to throw the ball at a cricket game? Wait, is it? Cricket game is a follow behind. Baller. Baller, yes. Correct. Yes. Okay. So can you pick up next one for me, Denise? I think only one left, missing single. Yes, missing single. So Pippi, tell me, um, how do we call who has to hit the ball at a baseball game? Uh, is it a batter? Batter, correct. Yes. So has everyone finished? I got BYZ line. BYZ, okay. BYZ is going as well. Okay, number two, let BYZ, okay. Number three, you should be on. Okay. Number three, go on. Play Kim's game with a partner. Look at the picture on this page for 30 seconds. Okay, so you have like 30 seconds to look at the pictures there. And then you have, uh, can you remember all the words associated with each sport? So this time I will name only a name of the sports and you have to tell the words that is associated with the game, okay? So you have 30 seconds to look at the pictures there. <clears throat> Okay, close your book again. Okay, so our name, uh, I will give the name of the sports and you have to give the vocabulary that associated with the game, okay? So how about horse riding? Horse riding or horseback riding? Rider, saddle. Riders, saddle. Reins. Yes, correct. So how about baseball? Everyone, baseball. Like cap. Cap. And uh, uh, like better. Better. Yeah, I only know that. I only know that. So how about the other scenario? So the the long 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 series, the other one is Is that include glove? Gloves, yes. Gloves is also included. And? Picture. Picture, yes, correct. Picture. So, okay, I'll, I'll tell the last one. How about athletics? Only three words there, right? Uh, running, doubling. Running, doubling, and high jump. High jump. High jump. High jump. Okay, okay, one more, one more. And um, cricket. 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 
Stamps. 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 Batman. Batman. Yes. Batman. Yeah. Bola. Batman and uh, stamps. Right. So either you get familiar with all these games, right? Then they're all familiar to the language. Come on, ask the vocabulary. Okay. And then uh, there may be some new words for you, right? <clears throat> okay, so is there anyone, uh, is there anything that you want to ask me about the categories or about the games? No. No, okay. So we'll move to use of English, Kanbana. What is Kanbana? Tell me, what is Kanbana? Kanbana is about your language. A command now is a noun. Oh my goodness, we have that past and on. Yeah, a command now is a noun with another noun, an adjective or a verb before it. A part of your general in command now. Okay, command now so the man power for it. It's a noun with another noun. So, oh, noun, noun, go look at, uh, sorry, noun, noun, go bang now. We are noun to cool net, the time now to cool net, bang now, let's get nine below. Adjective to cool net, noun to cool net, bang now, let's get nine below. Bob to cool net, noun to cool net, let's bang now, let's get nine. Egg on it, go no, bang your restaurant, noun to cool it, and you know, don't know. I don't know, so I'll go bang now, no question, you know, 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 now, now, anyway, yes, uh, there are now the long bomb your man, now the long name in the bomb your she house or common on the corner. I mean, I snap hockey in a bomb that comes around, and now the non don't have it by. We know I talk people, there's a non. Our common now, so there are now the long bomb in bomb, a double adjective and non a bomb in bomb, a double bomb in non a bomb in bomb. Okay, so is there any other words that you know about now, non common now? So, you know, you had a now and now they're bound by common on the digital stop the devil. The take out what's in the bar in it. Detail what's in the bar in it. Go in the game, not to get a lonely, long, 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 Bubble tea, okay, bubble and tea, yes. No, no. Hair dresser. Hair dresser, hair and dresser, yes, correct. Hair dresser, no, no. And? She did like that. Go on, you know. How about classroom? Classroom, right? So they are also now now kombana. Okay, now now kombana your people. As it's just now now ne bang hai kombana ni long 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 Oh, can you type them in? Let me type them in the Yamaha show. Walking stick. Uh, walking stick. So you take it walking as an adjective, right? Walking or adjective in the Yamaha show. Walking, I'm going to say, Bob, I am 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 going to say, uh, software, hardware. Software, hardware, yes. 
not fall, right? Greenhouse, right? Yes. Greenhouse definitely has a greenhouse like that, right? Our uh, adjective net noun that um so high words we use here, right? Like whiteboard, black bulb, right? Okay, so how about past paper? Uh past paper. Yes, past paper. So how about buff and at uh, buff and now compound now? Buff the low net bound high, buff net now the long bound high compound now jar. Washing machine. Washing machine, yes. We are gonna tiny build out of new walking stick, washing machine, yes, swimming pool, right? And like hair card, shield break. Uh, football stadium. Football. Stadium. Stadium. Football stadium is a uh, now now hold. Right? Now now about that, right? I'm kind of sure the long your light a little bit. Okay, Wiling you're typing, right? Wiling. Points. Ah, uh, okay. Yes, that one too. And chopstick, yes. Okay, I look down how I feel about my own. I go on a ก้าวยามิชิเอ้ควายยามิชิเอ้ตะคาลิเตอร์จะไฮไฟแคนดี้ยามิชิเอ้นะไอ้อะไรจะดิชเนอร์มาเปลี่ยนสีอ่ะล
切，我都变乖了，这玩意儿。阿拉讲一样 ，nameless 讲一样，所以要么说帮手不好，阿拉说奶奶奶奶变多样些，奶奶讲一样奶奶变多样些，奶奶奶妈不见哪里变多样些，晓得喏？所以说嘛，说阿咪阿六快要上了嘛，就是要批来呀，没米啦，没得。班五所以班内班内班内，班内五，好不？班内五，班内啦，班内班内来上这个啦 ，Tom's Grandma James 嘛，班内班内班内，班内五所以，班内，班阿奶五阿嘞。我话你，我话你奶奶好点唔啦？哦，奶奶奶奶帮派帮手宝宝，好点咯？就七步一一，叫帮你帮你帮派，你七步一一。然后呢？然后呢？还是什么人啊？好点，哦，不啦不啦，一啊，就你妈喂的，好点，哦，你妈喂的，就你奶奶奶帮派，好点，哦，七步一一，就是那一里多一，一里多一，然后七步一一是帮手宝宝，你帮派呀？我那时候也是蛮蛮蛮的，好点。Okay, so our so a ten minutes we are speaking about it. Now, our speaking about walking birds as an end of the questions in the quiz below. So, a questions of sports. So, number one is what does a football referee do? So, the answer has been given. Like he makes sure the players follow the rules, right? So that is the responsibility of a referee. So, how about number two? What does a goalkeeper do? So, what is his responsibility? Hello, our goalkeeper. Okay, cut the ball. To catch the ball, okay, go pan be ya, eh, be ya. Hello, be ya, de le. Have it, lah. To catch the ball, right, and to defend the goal post, right, so defend it, be ya, ta gue be ya, ha, na tu ye, tu ma yo, be ya, ang lo, right, go pan ah, but in other words. So how about number three, what does a golf caddy do? What do they have to do? To carry the golf bag. Yes, they to carry the golf bag, correct? So how about number four? In baseball, who throws the balls and who hit it? So baseball, but do I have to do a panel, eh? Baseball. Pitcher. Pitcher throws the ball and the batter takes it, right? Yeah, correct. How about in cricket? Who throws the ball and who hits it? But do I have to do a cricket match out? No. Bowler, right? Bowler throw the ball and batsman hit the ball, right? So I call what you do, not game, right? So cricket and baseball, my job. Ballon did that. The ballon get be as a team. I'm just gonna call what you do, right? So how about um number six, right? In basketball, how do you score points? So best of my score below you, man. I'm not below you. Like any time a player puts the ball to the basket, you can go. You can yes, get we can get points, right? We have to throw the ball into the basket, right? At that time, we score, right? So A and M A I, right? Our marking system, our blue ball, I don't know something, you know. And how about Sema? Why is there a net on the tennis court? So tennis court, mom, little net they see on it, on the tile. Hello, Lieutenant. It's kind of like a fence, right? So a fence for real way. It's uh like recognized as a territory for each of the player. เอ่อเปลี่ยนเดียวเช่นที่เทอร์ริทอรี่ตั้งแต่ปีนั้นจังหวะที่ไปกาลีไปเนี่ยจังหวะที่ไปกาลีไปเนี่ยไอ้เร
ตอนนี้เราเนี่ยดูเลยค่ะเอ่อเอ่อเอ่อเอ่อเอ่อเอ่อเอ่อเอ่อเอ่อเอ่อเอ่อเอ่อเอ่อเอ่อเอ่อเ